Release the hearts and begin to share. Begin to call on God. Hey, Hey! Father, we worship you. Adonai, we give you glory. We give you all the praise, O oh Lord. We give you all the adoration. You alone deserve all the honor. Hadada Bashaya. Atoda Bakabada Baha. Hey! Kantada Basobe de Bekaba. Kabada Bashato de Bede Bekabaya. Padaba Katone Mekapa. Panama Shanto de Bekabaha. Kabada Boshanta de Bede Bekaba. A Padaba Shanto de Bekaba. Ebede Bekabanto de Bekaba. A Padaba Shaya. You have come unto Mount Zion. Mm. This gathering is not unto man. No. It's not unto me. This gathering is not unto me. It's unto God. This gathering is not unto you. It's unto Jehovah. It's unto Jesus, the Son of the living God. And this evening, this morning, this afternoon, wherever you are, wherever the time is, wherever you find yourself, I want you to know that you have come unto Mount Zion. You have come to the city of the living God. You have come to the heavenly Jerusalem. You have come to Jesus, to the mediator of the new covenant. And you have come to the sprinkling. Ah! You have come to the sprinkling of the blood. The blood that speaks better things. Ah! Kantaya! The sacrifice that speaks better things than the blood of Abel. Apanamasuya. Pantanamakapaya. Apanamasuya. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 
Thank you, Elohim. Thank you, Elion. Lift up your voice and begin to give Jesus the glory. Lift up your voice and begin to give Jesus the praise. Ah. Karaboshea. Pantona makapaya. Apana masuni mikapa. Kadaboshada bahaya. Hey! Kadaboshada bahaya. I worship you, Adada Bashaya. The presence of God is here. Adada Bosude Behaya. Hey, you are here. Kadada Bashaya. Kabada Bosubidi be Kabada Babahaya. I worship you, Adada Boshada Be Kabahaya. I worship you, Adada Boshada Baba. You are here. Adada Basha. Come, Tada Basudi Be Kabaya. Hey, Apana Masuya, this evening you have come to the way maker, to the promise keeper, to the light in our darkness. Ah, you have come to Jesus. I worship you. I worship you. Hey, Kadada Baba. Way maker. Miracle work. Ah! Kadara basu de beha. Kadara basu de beka bahaya. Pananama sune me kapaya. Release the hearts and share. I feel the power of God. Hey! Lie in the darkness. You've come to get so many hours, by the way. <laughs> you are in get so many hours. Ah! It's going to be a great day today. <laughs> ah, Kadada Bashaya. Thank you, Jesus, for your mighty hand. Thank you, Jesus, for your miracle working power. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Kadada Bashaya. Hey, Kadada Basudia. Panama Kapaya. It's going to be a great night. It's going to be an awesome night. Turning lives around. I worship you. Hey. How? Hadada Bashahaya. Kadada Basudibia. Listen to me. Release the heart. Release the heart. Go into your friends list. Begin to share. Begin to share. Go into your friends list and begin to share. Go into it and share. Invite your family members and your friends. I command every limitation set against tonight's service to break. Hey! That is who you are. Hey! I feel the power of God. I feel the glory of God. You are on Mount Zion. I know you have a lot of problems. Some of you, you are down in your spirit. You are even fighting with yourself if you should go to sleep. Ha! Ah. You are fighting if you should go to sleep. Listen to me. That is the spirit of, of hopelessness. The spirit of hopelessness talking to you every time you come on you are reading somebody else's testimony and it's not going to be you tonight. Why don't you just go to sleep? Ah! But I tell you Jesus is here. Hmm. The way maker the promise keeper the one when you have been denied access, when you have been denied, he goes and he makes sure that it is approved. That Jesus is the one I'm talking about. That Jesus, ha, the way maker, the promise keeper, the light in our darkness, Kadabashaya, tonight. Whatever be the case, Waymaker, the miracle worker is here. 
Whatever be your case. I have one question to ask you. Is anything too hard for God? Is anything too hard? Mm, mm. I'm too excited already. Mm, 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 mm. Is anything too hard for him? Is anything? Kadabasuya. Huh? Mana makapaya. Is anything too hard for God to do? Is it your purpose? Your womb? Your job? What is it? Depression? Sicknesses? What is it? Is it too hard for him to do? Oh no. Oh no. The other thing is, we know him, Apaya, eternal word ministry. We know him, Apaya, to do exceedingly, abundantly, above all that we can think. I command every limitation to break in the name of Jesus. We know him to do exceedingly, abundantly, above everything we can think and ask of. The brother whose testimony I shared. The brother whose testimony I shared. Release the hearts. All hundred of you. Release the hearts quickly. And share when you come on. The brother whose testimony I shared. The brother said. He has been denied. In fact. When he turned in his visa application. It was not admitted. Everybody else that was admitted. Was denied. Everybody else's application that was admitted was denied. His, Daniel, his was not even admitted. They didn't even take it. But he said he fought for it again. Mm, 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 mm. And then on the Monday, on the Monday, ah, I called them out. And I said to him, the Lord is telling me that your life has been stagnant. And I pray, most of you were on when I was praying for him. And I pray for you that within three days, within 72 hours, within three days, may your destiny be set back on course, Kadabashaya. He said, today, today mark the 72 hours. Today, mark the 72 hours. He said, he went into his email. I don't know who I'm talking to. I don't know who I'm talking to. He said, he went into his email and behold, and behold, whether an angel did it, whether Jesus himself did it, whether the immigration officers did it, whether his uncle did it, whether his brother did it, it did not matter. He said when he went into his email, huh, the approval for his visa was there. When he went into his email, the approval for his visa was there. It was the 72 hours. And it didn't matter who did it. Some of you, you are worried about who is going to do it for you. You are worried about how is it going to come about. All your faith should be on is that the man of God, the woman of God said 72 hours. Hey, let me check on the 72 hours. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kadabashaya. Hadadabasuya. I feel the power of God. I cannot stand still. Hadadabashede behaya. There's a certain people that I have to pray for right now. And I'm waiting for the other people to get on because I don't want to pray and leave them. Release the hearts and share quickly. Quickly, the power of God is here. The glory of God is here. Those of you that have eyes, you can see an angelic being standing next to me right now. You can see it. 
You can see it at my back. You can see it if you have eyes. The power of God is here. Hmm. He said he checked his mail. And behold. <laughs> he checked his mail. And behold. It was there. The visa was approved. Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. I don't know what God you serve. I don't know what Jesus. Ay, 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 ay. But if it's the Jesus that I serve. If it is the Jesus that I serve. Kadada basahaya. Kedebo sudi bekabahaya. Kada basuni mikapahaya. If it is the Jesus that I serve. Then this evening you have nothing to worry about. To be honest. All you have to do is just believe. Oh, that's it. That's it. When Lydia came on, she just believed. Oh my God. It, it seems so easy. You know, what do I just have to believe? Yeah, that's it. Obviously, he was expecting something. That's why he checked his email. Because I prayed and I said 72 hours. And it was 72 hours today. And he checked his email and behold, it was there. It was there. Kadabashahaya. Hey! <laughs> hey! Adadabashaya. Kadabasudibia. Listen to me. There is nothing too hard for God. The doctors may have told you. You can't have kids. You have this. You have that. I was telling you guys yesterday. Some of you, you go... And a, a human a human mouth and mouth a human mouth opens up and tell you something and you believe it. But then when you come here, another human mouth telling you something, you don't believe it. But if you will believe the word of the Lord, the Lord said, Isaiah said, Whose report will you believe? You went to the doctor. And the doctor said, you have this, you have that. Even some of you, when the doctors did the test, they can't even find out what's wrong with you. They just know you have something, but they can't even diagnose it. A human mouth said it all. A human mouth. You come to the house of God. You come unto Mount Zion. Isaiah said, Whose report will you believe? God's report or your doctor's report? Whose report this evening, this morning, this afternoon, wherever you find yourself, you have come unto Mount Zion. You have come unto Mount Zion. Whose report are you going to believe? Which one are you going to take? I wish that all of you will have Lydia's faith. She said, woman of God, I'm drinking the water today and I'm letting you know it is the last time. And she said, when I go to the doctor's office, the doctor better tell me. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> <laughs> she said, the doctor better tell me that the fibroid that he saw is no longer there. He better tell me. I said, oh yeah, what type of faith is be this? Hey, and lo and behold, when she went to the doctor, they did the test. The first doctor couldn't believe his eyes, so they did another test. Both doctors confirmed that she no longer has fibroid. When she prayed, there was even a day, those of you that are on, you will remember. I called for people that are fibroid to pray for them. And Lydia also said that she wants to be prayed for, and I said, no, I will not pray for you. Why? Because 
you are healed. I said that. I said that. To her, I'm not going to pray for you because you've been healed already. Some of you, you would have taken offense and left the Facebook live. You would have left. Taken offense and gone. But she said amen and believed it. When she went, the test proved so. Whose report this morning will you believe? Whose report will you believe? What I hate to do the most is pray over the same situation over and over and over again. Why? Is, is God deaf? Huh? Can Jesus not hear? Huh? Huh? Obviously he can. But Timaeus was hanging on a tree when he kept calling on Jesus to come and have mercy on him so he can hear. We know that. So why do I have to keep praying over the same situation again? If Jesus can hear and he's healing other people that are here, but you, your situation is still coming back, then who, who should we blame here? Today must mark the end of the days that you come here and I'm praying over the same situation. This problem must be fixed for you to go to another level to encounter a newer problem. Then we'll be praying for them. I want to pray for new and better problems for you. Why? Because the higher you go, the bigger your problems get. And you need to go higher. It's about time you went higher. It's about time you went higher. Why? Because the God that you said, he's the God of all flesh. There's nothing too hard for him to do. Nothing too hard. Nothing. Nothing too hard for him to do. If he has healed somebody of AIDS, why can't he heal you of whatever disease that they can't even find? He should be able to heal you. Junior David, I want you to come to the camera quickly. Junior David, I need to come to the camera. Junior David, request to come to the camera quickly. Kadaba Shahaya. Release the hearts. Release the hearts. I know some of you are caught up in the atmosphere. Release the hearts and share. Release the hearts and share. Tonight is Gethsemane hour. A lot of praying. A lot of prophecies. A lot of casting out devils. Kadabashaya. And I hope that you will all fix your cameras. Fix your cameras. Because if I have to call you to the camera, please respond diligently. Quickly. Kadabashodebeha. Kebedebo shadabaha. Sobedebeha. Kedebo shatadabaha. Kabadabashobedebehaya. Release the hearts. Release the hearts. Tap into this great atmosphere. The power of God is here. Look at that, brother. <laughs> Look at how happy he is. <laughs> One of God. Good evening. How are you? I'm good, and you? Good. Share your testimony to encourage us. The power of God is here indeed. Amen. 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 So, what, what happened was, uh, oh, man. Mm. what happened was, uh, yeah, man, I, I, I had, uh, we, we, we finished our voluntary program and then we were asked to move out and then apply. So we had some contract with some universities and then they gave us some documents. Mm -hmm. So we came to apply and then they denied everybody. Mm. So my own was um, unadmitted. So what does that even mean? It means that they did not even admit it to deny you. <laughs> yes. Yours was even worse than the other ones. <laughs> yes, please. So they will not even admit you so that they can deny you. <laughs> yes. Wow. So, uh, fortunately, I had a friend who introduced you to me and we started up, uh, watching you. So mm -hmm. we started at 21 and then you called us and he told us that we should put our faith in everything that we are we are doing and that god is going to do something marvelous at the end of the 21 mm -hmm. i said okay so i started following you we started praying 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 then last week last week i applied again i applied and then on monday he yeah. called me and then 
you 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 prayed with me. I was just watching. I wasn't expecting a, a call. You wasn't even expecting me to call you. I just no, called not you. At you all. accepted it. I was Out lying down. So I was and I prayed yes. with you. Yeah. <laughs> So I received it and he said you want to pray with me and he prayed and he told me that um, you are bringing me back to my destined route and that you are, you are giving me 72 hours, that is three days. Right. Three days I have to get back to I my said, route. So I, I, I said your life, your destiny has been stagnant and I'm praying for you to be returned back onto your destiny's route. Yes. And that exactly. I said I give you 72 hours, three days. Yes, please. For yes, that please. to turn around for you. Yes, right. Please. Yeah. So... I receive it in good faith and I continue to watch and then I continue to watch and I've been praying. So um, it was like a coincidence because uh, when I went, they told me, okay, I should be expecting my mail. So I said, okay, woman of God has given me three days, meaning she's seen something ahead of the consulate or the. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so well, yesterday I was expecting the mail, I wasn't getting anything. I said, okay, woman of God has given me three days. So, so you've been wait. checking your mail. I'm checking my mail. Hey! Every I love you know your faith got it about the fact that I said I give you three days and yeah. you were checking your mail every other day. Yeah. It means you have received the prayer. Yes. And because yes, you have received the prayer, and because I don't pray for people out of my own will, but you received the prayer. On the yes, third yes. day, you have to be there. Yes, exactly. And, exactly. And so, this afternoon I was with my friends and we were just um, around and I said, oh, let me check my mail again and see what's, what's there. And then when I check the mail, I've been checking since morning. I was there. Oh, it's thin cut off. Kadaba, Shadabaya. When he checked the mail, he was there. Jesus, Jesus, Kadaraboshaya, Panama Kapaya, Pantoni Minimiha, Kadabasudi Bikabaya, release the heart and share. The power of God is here. Go ahead. When, yes. you, check, when you check the mail. When I check the mail, I receive the approval in Spanish, approvada. Mm -hmm. And I said, so I showed it to my friends and they started checking and they said, yes, I've been approved, I've been approved. Immediately, I started calling all of them and they said, call woman of God, send woman of God message because I can't wait to hear your testimony. Hey! <laughs> Hallelujah! <laughs> I pray for all of you under the sound of my voice that the way this man is laughing, I pray <laughs> that that same will be for all of you in the mighty Amen. name of Jesus. Whatever Amen. approval, you are looking for release the heart as I'm praying this prayer. Release the heart as I'm praying this prayer. Kadabashaya. Whatever approval you are waiting for, whatever approval, whatever judgment you are looking Amen. forward to, in the mighty Amen. name of Jesus, Amen. I turn into this 72 hour turnaround for you. Yeah. And I declare that all 170 of you under the sound of my voice will receive such a testimony in the matchless name of Jesus. Where is the other guys? Where are the other guys? I want to pray for them. Where are they? <laughs> they are around. Go and give the, go and give the thing to uh, Atinga so I, can, I, uh, uh, so I can pray for you. But I love the way you are laughing. I love the way you are so excited. Ay, 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 ay. That is the God that we serve. That is the mighty God that we serve. Listen to me. This man, he's been watching the Facebook Live, backing him with faith, tapping into everything we do, and God has done it for him. All of you. I want to pray for each and every one of you, one by one. So hand the, hand the video yeah. to one of them. He said he liked the way I'm laughing. <laughs> I like the way he's laughing because he's received the testimony. <laughs> yes. How many of you are waiting for approvals? How many of you? Yes, all of us. All of, us. All of you. All yes, right. madam. Daniel, since you have already received yours, give the phone to somebody who has not received his approval. <laughs> yes. I pray for you. 
Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus, close your eyes, please. Amen. I pray for the both of you. In the Amen. mighty name of Jesus. I receive. Amen. The same Jesus who has visited Daniel. I pray that as you put in the application within 72 hours, may you receive Amen. the same testimony. In the name of Amen. Jesus, may you receive Amen. the same answer by the power Amen. of the Holy Ghost. Any demonic hand at Kataya, a Panama Kapaya, a Pantoni any altars fighting your destiny. I destroy Thank those you. altars by the fire of the Holy Ghost in the matchless name of Jesus. Amen. I release your breakthrough for you. I release your breakthrough for you. I come Amen. against any denial in your life Amen. in the name of Jesus. Any delay, strike by the power of the Holy Ghost. Be set free Jesus. from every snail of the fowler. In the mighty name of Jesus, any evil Jesus. eye that is watching you, both of you, especially the, the, the shorter one, a monitoring spirit is watching you. I curse that spirit. I drive that spirit out of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus, receive it. Receive. Receive it. Receive your approval. In the name of Jesus, I pray. We receive it in Jesus' name. Amen. We receive this. What is your name? You, the one in the red. What is your name? Release the heart. Evans. 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 Evans, how are your dreams like? Do you even remember them? Um. Okay. I've been dreaming, but um, quite long ago. Nowadays, I don't dream like that. Mm. There's a monitoring spirit. I've prayed mm -hmm. for you. But there's a monitoring spirit. Somebody, it's as if though you do things and then immediately you're about, you're about to break through, it stops. Mm -hmm. Like you do something and immediately you're about to enjoy the fruit of it. Something happens. Mm -hmm. And I sense mm -hmm. that it's a... I sense a monitoring spirit as I was praying. I sense a monitoring spirit watching you. I cast that spirit. I saw two eyes watching you. And I pray for those that eyes to be blind in the name of Jesus. Please be very Amen. careful when you when you go to sleep. Pray with Psalm 35. All right. Okay. Yeah? And start picking up your Bible. Psalm 35. Start reading your Bible and pray okay. you to commit yourself to God. You know why? Because mm -hmm. there's there's a lot of contention, but God is okay. God is faithful. God is faithful. Amen. There's Amen. a lot of contention, and pick up mm -hmm. your your walk with God. You may not be a place you can go to church all the time, but now you don't have to go to a building to have church. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have. You don't have to do that. You can partake of anything that has the anointing of God there. Do that, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. God okay. bless you. you. God bless you all. I thank God for thank your you. life. May you receive the Amen. same testimony in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. God bless you all. Amen. 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 Release the heart. Release the heart quickly and share. Don't wait for anyone. The power of God is here. The glory of God is here. I don't know if you people can even see that it's bright. It's so bright. Kadabasaya. Kadabasodebe. Kadabasodebeha. Those of you that are on that are sick, start releasing the diseases, those infirmities. You are on Mount Zion. Jesus Christ is here. Jesus Christ is here. Start releasing every fibroid, every cancer, every ace, every kidney problems, whatever disease, diabetes, whatever it is, release them now. Begin to confess. I relieve my sickness, barrenness, fibroid. I leave it at Mount Zion. The word of God says, on Mount Zion, there is deliverance. On Mount Zion, there's holiness. I leave all my problems. I leave it at Mount Zion. My financial problems, I leave them at Mount Zion. I'm delivered. I'm set free. Begin to pray. Hadabasaya. Hadabasodebeha. Where are you? Let me pray for you. Please release the hearts. My God, don't wait. Jesus. 
Somebody release the heart just now. You have kidney stones. You release the heart just now. I saw you are releasing. You saw I saw you releasing the heart. I saw kidney stones. I saw kidney stones. You are being set free from kidney stones. Right now, as you are releasing the heart, there's somebody watching me. Releasing the heart and you will suffer from kidney stones. The Lord is setting you free right now. There's somebody under the sound of my voice. You owe $150,000. You are in debt of $150,000. $150,000. You are in debt. I see you releasing the heart in faith. And the Lord is telling me to tell you. Hmm, that your debt is cancelled. I don't know who this is for. I don't know who is for. I don't know who is for. Some of these things, when I say them, people are like, oh my God, it can't be true. How can 150,000 debt be cancelled? Yes, it can. If God says that that is cancelled, it doesn't matter if it is millions, it is cancelled. I command every limitation, break in the name of Jesus. Every limitation, break, every limitation, break by the power of the Holy Ghost in the master's name of Jesus. Every limitation against eternal world, break, break, break. All 200 of you release the heart. Release the heart. Kidabasaya, Matoni Mikapaya. Break in the name of Jesus. Every delay. Everyone watching me, you just came on. You are struggling with delay. I come against the spirit of delay. In the name of Jesus. Kadabasaya. Matoni Mikapaya. Release the heart. Kadabasuya. Break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Kadabasaya. Panama Kapani Mikataya. Pantoniata, a Panama Kapaya, Hanama Sunimia, any wickedness of the wicked against you, anyone under the sound of my voice, struggling with wickedness of the wicked, wickedness of the wicked, wickedness of the wicked, it must come to an end in your life in the name of Jesus. Somebody release the heart. And a hundred and fifty thousand dollar debt. I don't know who is this. A hundred and fifty thousand dollar debt hanging upon your head has been cancelled. Cancelled. Ay, 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 ay. My God. My God. You know what? There are some of you you don't believe. That's fine. Nana B. Nana B received a job as a director of nursing by releasing the heart. Nana B, one of our members. She released the heart in faith. Believe in God. I have said this testimony over and over and over. She even came on and said the testimony. Many of you were on when we said the testimony. She said, I said everybody should release the heart. And she was. She be got a job as a director of nursing. A job she didn't even apply for. And as we are talking now, she has that job. You are watching me. Unmovable. The rock of Gibraltar, unmovable, like that. Hey, let me tell you something. You can be gentle all you want, but when you read the Gospels, huh? Gentility never got anybody anywhere. I want to tell you that. On Mount Zion, gentility doesn't get anyone anywhere. There's deliverance. There's holiness. There's possession of possessions, and the house of Jacob shall be like a fire. Fire doesn't bend smoothly. Does it bend smoothly? No. Some of these things that I'm pronouncing now, because the power of God is here, and the presence of God is here, if you believe that the delay has come to an end in your life, Jesus said these words that I speak, they are spirit and they are life. These words that I speak, Ay, 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 ay. Behold, I have given you authority and power to tread upon scorpions and snakes and to overcome all powers of darkness. If you will just take the word and just grab onto it. Many of you were on when I prayed for Daniel. Did he fall under the anointing? 
many of you have prayed and they fell on the anointing he just said i receive i receive amen and he got off the facebook live on of the camera three days 72 hours his testimony now you are watching him he can't even stop laughing can he no that's what happens when jesus visits you you can't stop laughing there's proof that's proof that's proof and i'm telling you at the comfort of your home just believe just believe kadabasaya hapana makapaya just believe kadabosuni mikapaya where is ohinere boysiako come to the camera quickly i don't know if you know how to fix your camera but come to the camera quickly or type something so i can see you and pray for you i need to pray for you quickly i i called to pray for you because i called your husband to get you on quickly so i can pray for you because the lord showed me to pray for you so bring yourself to the camera or write something so that i can i can i can use it to call you to the camera and pray for you because you need me to, i need to pray for you it's very very important type something or bring yourself to the camera if you don't know just just comment amen or something and let me see it kadabashaya release the heart still release the heart kadabashaya there are some of you watching me listen to me the lord is telling me and we're going to deal with all tests tonight so make sure that you stay and invite your family members if you have family members on facebook that are going through the same things you are going through make sure that you invite them there are some of you watching me you are struck you're dealing with the monitoring spirit monitoring spirit what do i mean by that a monitoring spirit is when you are moving forward in life everything is going well in life everything is going well in life you are climbing you are climbing you are climbing you are taking an exam all of a sudden it's time for you to pass then you lose with just one point you are getting well you are sick you are getting well you are getting well a week from the fact that you are well all of a sudden something happens and then you are sick again you've gone to the hospital again one trouble after the other one trouble after the other one trouble after the other you are sick you are getting better you are getting better you are sick but you are getting better but all of a sudden another thing comes in you work you are working you are saving money you reach a level you reach let's say two thousand dollars in your bank account then something happened you have not been able to cross over three thousand limitation all these are, are by 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 a monitoring spirit monitoring you some of you you like ah what at all is going on you wonder yourself what at all is going on why can i move forward why am i so struggling why is it that i take two steps forward and i come down i take two steps forward and i come down it's like somebody's watching you some of you you can literally it's come to the level where you feel like somebody is like watching you somebody is just watching you because immediately you make an attempt to go somewhere you come down you make an attempt to go somewhere you come down another sickness another thing another that you when you spend your money you waste your time you're driving around you have applied for a job you have applied and applied and applied and applied and applied all of a sudden you got an interview you are going on an interview your car break down you miss the interview it's a monitoring spirit it's a monitoring spirit and as i was praying earlier before i came on the lord said to me deal with the monitoring spirit that is monitoring your people there's a monitoring spirit monitoring some of you some of you are watching me you don't understand altars but that's where they come from that is how you are able to they you are limited because there's a monetary spirit monitoring you and it limits you but today the wickedness of the wicked must come to an end the wickedness of the wicked release the heart all of you the power of god is here the wickedness of the wicked must come to an end in the mighty name of jesus
Mana masuni mikapaya. Pantoni mikata. Apana masuni mia. If you are watching me and nothing is going on with you, I called you to the camera, but they won't accept. I don't know what's going on, but I pray for you still. I wish you would come to the camera because everybody I've called to the camera and prayed for. The Lord working for them. For them. Lift your hands quickly. Any monetary spirit monitoring your destiny causing you to be delayed in life. I cast that spirit. Close your eyes. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. I command that monetary spirit to come out of your life. I cast it out into the abyss. In the name of Jesus. Kadabashaya. Any limitation against you. Too much limitations. You can't even take two steps forward. What's going on? What at all? Huh? What at all? Release the heart. All 200 and something of you, release the heart. Release the heart. Release the heart. What at all is going on that you alone, you can't prosper? You may, you may take two steps forward, three steps back. You can't even save money. Is what I'm saying true? Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? I can can hear you hear me? Even your camera is not working. Hmm. Have you, you have an issue with saving money. You come to a level and it, it comes down. You've never been crossed to cross in a level. Huh? Yes. Hello? Yes? Yes or no? Can you hear me? I can I can hear you. All right. I'm talking to you, though. So I need you to respond. A financial issue whereby you are, you are, it's like a limit set to you. You are not able to cross financially. You work very, very hard, but you're not able to cross that level. Do you understand what I'm saying? Jesus. Please pray, oh, pray. Because some of you, your deliverance is here. But the devil will fight it. So I need you to really, really be able to pray. Pray, 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 pray. Pray, pray. Don't just sit and watch me. This is a war night. Don't just sit and watch. I want you to live here liberated from your situations, the things because the power and the glory of God is here to set you free. So don't just watch. Pray so that if I'm to call you to the camera, you are praying already. You understand? Kadaba sodebeha. Kedebo shadaba sobedebe kabadaba haya. I pray for you anyway. Omita ends. I pray for you by the power of the Holy Ghost. May the Lord set you free in Jesus' name. May the mighty hand of the living God set you free. In the mighty name of Jesus. Everyone under the sound of my voice. Everyone under the sound of my voice. Struggling with limitations. With the monetary spirit. Monitoring you. Monetary spirit monitoring you. I cast that spirit. I send that spirit back to sender. By the power of the Holy Ghost. In the mighty name of Jesus. I pray right now. Be set free. All 200 of you, under the sound of my voice, be set free from every monetary spirit. In the mighty name of Jesus. Anyone under the sound of my voice, struggling to make ends meet, struggling with limitations, I command those limitations, break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Kadabasaya, huh? Anyone under the sound of my voice, 
any demonic attack against any of you, limitations through sickness, come to an end now. Hi, 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 hi. There's somebody watching me. When you have sex, there's blood. Who's that? When you have sex, there's blood. Hi, hi, hi. When you have sex, there's blood. You are watching me now. When you have sex, there's blood. This is not, it's not your, you're not breaking your virginity. But when you tell me you have sex, there's blood. I pray for you. You don't have to say it's you. You don't have to say it's you. I pray for you. When I pray over the water and you drink it, I curse that evil spirit in you. It's an evil seed. It's an evil seed in you. You ate something. You ate food. That was not spiritually sound for you. In fact, I will go as far as to say that the day that you ate it, you remember. Because immediately you finished eating, you felt like throwing up. You felt like throwing up. And ever since then, every time you have sex with your husband, there's blood. I pray for you. In the name of Jesus. I command that demonic seed in your belly, in your womb, to disappear, to melt out of your body. In the master's name of Jesus, be set free by the power of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name, such a demonic attack. My God. Such a demonic attack. Mm, mm. Mm, Jesus. Hadaba, lift your hands, my dear. Thank you, Lord. Lift your hands. Those of you that are on, I want you to type the city that you, some of you, you are watching me now. You have a place where you always dream about. You go there. Everybody has that place. It's a, a place of limitation. Your village. It could be your mother's village, your father's village. Every time you dream, you find yourself back there. I want you to type that place now. Because the power and the fire of God is here. And as you are typing, I want you to say, every demonic altar at this city whereby every time i'm dreaming i see it in my dream i destroy that that altar by the fire of the holy ghost do that it is a prophetic direction if you believe it it will work for you that's what the lord is telling me we need to pray against altars fighting you from your background if you are watching me some of you you dream we did this the last time it worked for so many people Every time you dream, you're back to your old, old, uh, old city, a, a small city somewhere. Your old self, you are wearing oh, 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 uh, some different type of clothes. A pada basuya, Masha, it's you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to pray for you, Masha. Lift your hands, my dear. Is there any way you can do a youth like a? A complete 360 with your camera in your room, if you don't mind. Can you hear me? Sorry. Can you do a, yes, Can you please. stand up with your camera? Stand up. Stand up with your camera. Stand up. Are you standing up? Okay. Yes, please. Hmm. Lord, I thank you. Lift your hands. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus. Any evil eyes monitoring you. Delaying your breakthrough. I see it now. I see it now. I see it now. I pray for you, Orion. In the name of Jesus. Any satanic agenda against your destiny from your mother's house. Hey, you have yes, you can hear me. I can see you. I can see you. You have ears. 
I invoke the vengeance of Jehovah against you. In the name of Jesus, I curse you. I invoke the vengeance of Jehovah against you. May the judgment of God find you and locate you. Release her. Release her. Release her papers. Now in the name of Jesus. Now in the name of Jesus. Release her papers. Now by the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Lord. Guess what I see? Open your eyes. Guess what I see? I see someone holding your papers and your screen. Her screen is frozen, but I can see movement. And I see somebody, eh, a woman, holding her papers like this. Holding the papers like this. Like, I don't know how, if I have a paper, she's holding them like this, with both hands like this. Both hands like this. I pray for you. I wish you could come back to the camera. If you can come back to the camera. And as I was praying for you, I saw that she just did this and it fell. I saw that she just did this and it fell. The woman just did this and it fell. I pray for you, Oriere. Any demonic agenda, any satanic attack, any witchcraft, any witch that is sitting on your joy. Within three days, within 72 hours, within 72 hours, may the vengeance of Jehovah locate her. If I be a daughter of Zion, may the vengeance of Jehovah, all right, you can't even see May the vengeance of Jehovah visit your enemies, visit the witches, visit the altar, visit the strong man fighting you in the name of Jesus. And may the Lord put a testimony in your mouth in Jesus' name. By thunder, by fire. We are not joking tonight. Tonight is, not, tonight is a no joke night. We are not Amen. joking tonight. We are not joking tonight. You know why your camera froze? You know why it froze? Huh? It wasn't no. because you weren't doing anything. No. Yeah. Yeah. Immediately I was praying for you. I saw someone, huh? a woman, mm. clutching mm. on huh? yeah. to papers. And I believe it's your papers. And I began to talk yeah. to her. And she clutched on. And I said, in the name of Jesus, mm. and I saw the papers released. Listen to me. As I've prayed Amen. for you now, Amen. you're going to call me. There's going to be contention Jesus. in the house. A strange fight. Amen. Out of nowhere. Amen. And don't don't talk. Amen. It's Amen. not a battle we fight with. Amen. It's physical. Do you understand what I'm telling you? Huh? Okay. Don't talk. Yes, please. Just yes, please. Okay. And let God, because okay. I have my some mind will be. No, I'm in, I'm in. Do you understand what I mean? Amen. Your case Amen. now has yes, been please. put in the hands of an angel. And within three days, Amen. heaven must speak for you. Jesus. It is well. Amen. It is well. It is well. Some of these things, when I say them until the person come and testify, then you know that what I was saying was true. Some of these things, when I say them, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So me, I know. I know. I know. I know what I see. I know. Yvette, where are you? I need to pray for you. The Lord told me to honor your faith. Before I came on, the Lord told me to honor your faith. And everyone under the sound of my voice, believing God for a child. Please. Tap into this prayer. I'm about to pray for this woman. Because I will no long, I will not tonight for night. Because I have so much work I have to do. I may not pray for anybody that is looking for children. Yvette, come to the camera quickly. Yvette, come to the camera quickly. Come to the camera quickly, Yvette. Kadaboshaya. Uh, 
Yedi Johnson, Yedi Johnson, that's you, that's you, that's you. Yedi Johnson, come to the camera quickly, come to the camera, release the hearts. If you are under the sound of my voice and you are believing God for a child, God has done it in the, under this ministry four times. Doctors have told women, you cannot conceive, you cannot have children. And God turned it around four times, four times, four times. Some of them have come out and testified and you know it four times and today as i was praying the lord said honor the faith pray for because her faith has reached me you did something and the lord said i should pray for you i should call you to the camera and pray for you yedi yedi where are you yedi johnson where are you quickly quickly and i wish your husband was with you I wish your husband was with you. Kada Bashaya. Hey! Kada Daba Sobe Debe Kabahaya. Hadaba, sit, sit, sit down. Where are you? Kadabashadaba. Lift your hands. Put the camera down and lift your hands quickly. Anyone touching me, believing God of a child. Kada Sobe Debe Kaba. Amen. Is here, is here. Hold on, a minute. My husband is here. My husband is here. Hold on. Go and get him quickly. I, I love the way she runs. Look at that woman. Look at the faith of that woman. My God. My God. Look at the faith of that woman. Look at the faith of that woman. Where is she? Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at the way she's running. Look at the way she's running for her husband. Is he here? Is he there? Your husband is there. All right, good. Hi, sir. Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know, but the Lord told me to tell you that He is ready to honor your faith. In the Bible, says, without faith, it is impossible to please God. I have to just pray for your wife, but I want you to be there. That's all. Mommy, can you just stand up and lift your hands? Those of you believing God for children, please tap into this prayer. Tap into it. Tap into it. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. We're going to be together. Hold hands. Hold hands. Hold hands. Good. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know, sometimes I tell some of you, when you are praying with your husband or your wife, make sure you hold hands with them. As you guys held hands right now, guess what I saw? Their hand literally has merged to become one. I don't know how, like the Lord is opening my eyes to see this. It means that this union eh, is one and God is in it. I pray in the name of Jesus. I come against any drought. I prophesy into your lives as the daughter of Zion, as a child of the Most High God. That before this year ends, you both will have be pregnant in the name of Jesus. You will conceive a child before this year ends. Amen. Every fibroid. Any fibroid standing in your womb as a resistance, I cast it in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. I pray that the Lord will put the baby in your womb now in the name of Jesus. Amen. There's already a child in your womb. Amen. Amen. There is. Amen. I'm praying that the Lord said there's a child in your womb. Amen. I'm praying that the Lord just said to me, there's a child in your womb now. I pray for you. Amen. May Amen. You the test. Coming October and it should be positive. Amen. Amen. You already have it. As I was just Amen. Now, the Lord said, don't put a baby in her womb. There's already a baby in your womb. Amen. Amen. I thank you, Lord. Thank, thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. It is done, mommy. Lord. Let me talk to mommy. Amen. You know, mommy, there's a sister who came on, eh? 
And the doctors told her that she doesn't even have a, a, an ov a, a, a womb to put a baby in. Like her ovaries are just shut. Just forget okay. it. They told her, forget it. You understand? And yeah. I said here, after some fasting, I said, the Lord is giving five people babies. And when I was praying, I didn't even think she would be part of them because there are people who, who don't have problem with their wombs. Their wombs are fine. But mm. they didn't get it. And the woman Jesus. called me in the middle of the night after the day we fasted and we were ending the fast. She said, let me go and take the test. After we, we ended the fast, she said, let me go and take a test. That particular moment she took the test it was positive. Mm. When the doctor said, you don't have ovaries. How can you have children if you can't have ovaries? You don't have ovaries. <laughs> but she's pregnant as I'm talking now. Hallelujah. So I know what I'm saying. I will never call you to yeah. the camera and do all this. I don't need to do that. God has already yeah. proven himself in my ministry. I want Amen. you to believe that what I've done, I will never pray for you again for children. You know why? I don't need to. Because hmm. as I'm talking now, there's a baby in your womb. Amen. 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 And receive it. So from now on, how do you pray? Lord, I thank you for my baby. Thank you. I anoint my womb. If I Amen. pray over water, you drink it. Lord, let it go and uh, help my baby. Let it go and make my baby strong. That's the prayer she made. Because nobody Amen. prays to be pregnant when they are already pregnant. Is that so? <laughs> God bless you. And I Thank pray you, for Martin. everyone under the sound of my voice. Everyone under the sound of my voice. Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. Release the hearts. Release the hearts. There's somebody watching me. You are feeling so hopeless. You are feeling so hopeless. You are feeling so hopeless. You are like woman of God. It cannot be me. You are feeling so hopeless. You say, you, you, as I'm about to pray now, you have literally rejected the prayer in your heart that it, it seems too easy. It cannot be you. Why not? Why not? Why not? Can, why can't it be you? Is there anything too hard for God? Is there anything too hard for God? Why can it not be you? Why not? Why not? God said, to Jeremiah, Jeremiah, I am the God of all flesh. I am the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? Is there anything too hard for me? Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is there anything too hard for me? Nothing is too hard. For God to do. Have faith. As I'm about to pray this prayer. I want you to lift your faith back up again once more. I know you've been disappointed. I know that you have sold in your church. You have sold in your church. Yeah, Margaret Johnson is you. Yep, is you. You have sold in your church. You have sold in your church. You have sold in your church. You have sold and sold and sold and sold and sold and sold, Margaret. You have sold, Margaret. You have done all that you can, Margaret. You have done all that you can. And now you are on this Facebook Live and this woman wearing red, whom you've probably never seen before, telling you mm -hmm. that if you just release the heart, you can have your baby. <laughs> That's what you were thinking, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. That's what you were thinking. I know. Because immediately I was about to pray, the Lord said, address the doubt and the disbelief in Amen. one of the people watching. You see, the Spirit of God is here. Amen. If the Spirit of God is not here, while I'm about to pray, the other women who are very, very, very seriously looking for babies, and they know what God can do because they were on here when the other women got pregnant. Yes. They were on here, so they know what God can do. They are ready. Their faith is ready. But I couldn't yes. pray. Why? Because you, you were doubting. And God said, stop the prayer. 
stop the prayer and address her doubts. And so I'm doing that now. Do yeah. you believe that God is here? Yes. Have I ever spoken to you? No. Never. How did I know that that is how you are feeling right now? I was amazed. Because you have tried and tried and tried and tried and tried. You've done all that you can. You have prayed. You have done all that you can. Mm -hmm. And now, it seems too easy, doesn't it? Yes. It just seems too easy. It seems too easy. It seems too easy. Yes. It can be true because it seems too easy. That's mm -hmm. what you're thinking. But he has done it. Yes. He's done it for women here. Yes. And he can do it for you. Amen. You know, God has a great sense of humor. Mm -hmm. That you'll be running around uh, at the church, dancing, humping, lifting one leg, lifting one leg, lifting that, and then you come home, and then here he is in your bedroom while you've taken off your clothes. That's how God is. Yes. Great sense of humor. That mm -hmm. you should become pregnant the first time you come on somebody's Facebook Live while you have been chasing him, man. That's who he is. A great sense of humor. Mm -hmm. Do you believe now? Yeah. You believe now. <laughs> All right. I'm going to take you off the camera and I'm going to pray for everybody else. Mm -hmm. And I know that the next time you take that test, God will humor you. Amen. And when he humors you, please call me because I like funny stories. Mm -hmm. Will you do so? Yes. You've been through a lot. You have been through a lot but the lord is faithful all right yes and i think you need this to encourage yourself in the lord that god is with you and god will do it all amen right? all right so i'm going to catch you off the camera and i'm going to pray for all the women believing god for children and i want you to lift your faith again where you had your faith in the beginning when you started to seek god for children Go back to that place again. Mm. Is it possible to go back to that place again? Yes, amen. Are you able to go back to that place again? Yes. Of complete faith? Yes. That after I finish praying, that when you are about to end, you're about to get your period, you go and buy a pregnancy test. Would you believe that? Yes. Okay. Bless God. All right. Let me pray. That's the God that we serve. That's Jesus. Oh, He stops. He stops for people. He stops. He's here to visit people. He stops. Yeah. That's who Jesus is. Somebody said, well, there's about 250 people watching. Why? What about us? Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't operate on my own. I do as what God tells me to do. And God told me to stop the prayer and address her doubt. Because it's a season for miracle. So I had to stop. God is in control here, not me, God. And that's why I keep telling you, release the hearts. And whatever you are thinking, know that God is listening. Hmm. Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray. For all the women under the sound of my voice, believing you for children. All the women under the sound of my voice, Lord, believing you for children. I pray in the name of Jesus. Whatever is stopping them, I declare it be removed in the name of Jesus. I declare it be removed in the name of Jesus. Any satanic
it blockaged, whether it be fibroid, whether it be stones in your belly, whatever is stopping you from having children, I cast it to its root by the power of the Holy Ghost. I cast it to die now in the name of Jesus. And I pray. That the same Jesus, Kadada Messiah, the same Jesus, the same Jesus who visited the woman with the issue of blood and healed her and gave her a testimony. May the same Jesus. Who healed blind Bartimaeus? May that same Jesus put a testimony in your mouth. May that same Jesus change your destiny. May that same Jesus break every limitations set against your life. May that same Jesus cause the delay to come to an end. May that same Jesus put your enemies to shame. In the matchless name of Jesus. May that same Jesus wipe away your shame. May that same Jesus for your shame give you double glory. In the name of Jesus, a year by this time, I declare and I decree, for 10 women, 10 women, 10 women, 10 women, a year by this time, Ah. Ah. A year by this time. A year by this time. You will be dedicating your children in the mighty name of Jesus. I don't know how you do it. Ah. And frankly, I don't care how Jesus will do it. I just know that a year by this time, a year by this time, yeah, by me, a year by this time, Koroma, a year by this time, Johnson, you will receive your child. A year by this time, Maynard, a year by this time, uh, in Kudu, a year by this time, Kadabasuya, Pan Tony Kataya, Jesus, Embalu, Angelina, Kukua, a year by this time, a year by this time, oh God, Adabasaya, Pan Tony Mikapaya, hey, Kadabasuya. All of you, go and get your water now. Get your water now. Get it now. Get it now. The atmosphere just changed. The atmosphere just changed. Get your water now. Get your water now. The atmosphere just changed. Get it. Get it now. And yeah, by this time. A year by this time. A year by this time. Adabasuya. Pan Tony Mikapaya. A year by this time. A Panama Kapaya. A year by this time. A Tony Kataya. A Panama Sunikata. A Panama Kapaya. A year by this time. Oh. 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 A year by this time. You'll be carrying your children in the name of Jesus. And there is nothing the devil can do about it. There's nothing the devil can do about it. Kadabasude, we release the hearts quickly. Hayayadabasha, the power of God is here. I'm praying over the water. I'm praying over the water. There's some of you watching me sick in your body somebody has already been healed from kidney stones 
Some of you watching me, you have diabetes. The power of God is so strong here, my God. Oh my God. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Kidney stones healed already. Some of you watching diabetes. Some of you watching hypertension. Hypertension. There's somebody watching. Your hypertension is so bad. It's about to. It's great. It, the plan of it is to lead you to have stroke. Stroke. You've been thinking about. You. You've been. It's been. It's been coming upon you like you're going to have stroke. I'm going to pray against it. Kadabashaya. This water. This water. Take it now and lift it up. Take it and lift it up. There's somebody watching me right now. You're going to give it to somebody who has AIDS. You have a family member. You have a family member who has AIDS. Because of your because of your fruit. Because of your because of your of your of your faith. And I hear you praying over the water. I hear you praying over the water. I hear you praying over the water. Saying, I give, as my sister, as my, as my sister drinking, may she be set free from that sickness. I hear you praying. I hear you praying aggressively. Praying and praying and praying. Praying and praying and praying. Father, in the name of Jesus. Under this ocean, I pray over the water. Anyone under the sound of my voice. Sick anywhere in your body. Whether it be fibroid. Whether it be diabetes. Whether it be cancer. Whether it be hypertension. Whether it be high blood pressure. Whether it be headaches, whether it be kataya katoni kapa, haton tani kapaya, hinimi kapan toya, whatever it is, shea panika toya pa. From the crown of their head to the soles of their feet, wherever an affliction is. Wherever a sickness is, wherever a demonic attack is, boils, tumors, boils in the body, pain in the neck, pain in the back, pain in the legs, Hatona Makapaya, Father, in the name of Jesus. Your word said, they believed and therefore they spoke. And in the same spirit of faith, we believe and therefore we speak. I pray that your mighty power come upon this water. Everyone under the sound of my voice, let your mighty power come upon this water. And everyone that is watching me, in the name of Jesus, let your presence, let your glory come upon it now in the name of Jesus. Every infirmity afflicting anyone, depression. There's somebody watching me, you are depressed. As you drink the water, may the sweat of depression leave you in the name of Jesus. Somebody watching me, miscarriage upon miscarriage upon miscarriage. It is coming to an end now in the name of Jesus. Fibroid, melt by the power of the Holy Ghost. There is a man watching me. You are having issues with peeing. It burns. It burns when you pee. There's a woman watching me. You are not in menopause yet. But your period has ceased. As you drink the water, Kadabashaya, may the power of God, may the glory of God, and may the presence of God that is in the water 
cause every demonic attack, every satanic affliction, every foul spirit to leave you now in the matchless name of Jesus. There's somebody else watching me. Things are moving in your body. Oh Lord. Things are moving in your body. You are watching me now. You feel things moving in your body. And even as I'm praying now, you feel it moving. There's somebody watching me. Oh. Your hand, this particular hand, you are not able to do this. What I'm doing now, you're not able to do it. You're not able to do it. What I'm doing now, squeezing hand and releasing. Squeezing hand and releasing. Squeeze, you're not able to do it. Listen to me. After I'm done praying, begin to do it. You see that the pain has left you. The nerve pain. There's some of you watching. You have nerve pain. Pain in the nerve. Pain in the nerve. Release the hearts. The power of God is here. Release the hearts and share. And share. You have nerve pain. Nerve pain. Lord Jesus, every satanic agenda, every sickness, every infirmity, leave them in the name of Jesus. Be set free by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Be set free, be set free, be set free as you drink the water in the name of Jesus. I thank you, Lord. It is done. There's the movement in your chest, eh? I catch it. That's where it's from. That's what I saw. I saw it. I saw something moving in your bo somebody's body. A movement in your chest. Why should there be a movement in your chest? Why should there be a movement in your chest? I catch that movement. As you drink the water, may every demonic attack against your heart come to an end you see the pain you know patients come to the camera quickly patients come to the camera it was the pain in your chest and as i was talking it was moving as i was talking where's patients come back to the camera quickly 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 let me pray for you and cast that thing out of your life huh because it's going to serve us it was not moving initially it was just a pain in your chest but as i was talking it was trying to find its way out it was trying to find its way out. Hmm. Some of you, you think, oh, woman of God, every sickness you say is the devil. Well, if it's not the devil, who is it from? If the sickness is not satanic, then who is it from? Why should something be moving in her chest? Why? 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 Patients, come on quickly. Come on quickly, quickly, quickly. Hmm. Some of you, you don't know the things that we're doing. The, 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 hmm. I hope you understand. Come to quickly. Father, cause the camera to be well. When you came on, it was a pain in your chest. Is that so? Yes. But then when I was praying, it began to move. Yes. Yeah. So you know that it's a demonic affliction. Isn't it so? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Because why should a pain begin to move why should it serve like it's moving why and i went to the hospital for 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 checkup they said they did not see anything i went to the scan there's nothing they saw they don't see anything but you yes. feel the pain in your chest yes and then as i was praying it started moving yes oh my god put your hands on your chest I see that demon already. I see it now. I already know. I see where it's coming from. I see it. I see it already. Some of you, when I only invite you to the camera, you don't want to come on. Some of you, you think this is a joke. You think this is some sort of a party that we have gathered to just come and watch people. You have no idea. Hmm. I pray for you, patients. Lift your other hand and put your other hand on your chest. I pray for you. Amen. Oh. All right, you know what? Hold the camera. Hold it. It's okay. It's all right. Hold it and bring it down. I pray for you. I Amen. curse that demon. Amen. I command it out of your life in the name of Amen. Jesus. By Amen. the power of the Holy Ghost, I Amen. set you free in Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen.
you will not have any heart attack. Amen. I curse it in the name of Jesus. Every Amen. satanic agenda against your life to kill you before your time. Mm. I declare and I decree under mm. this atmosphere, under the heavens and in the earth, that you shall not die before your time. Amen. I curse it. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Thank Amen. You, Amen. May the Holy Ghost power fill your house. Amen. May the presence of God fill your house. Amen. I can the pain. Amen. It appear again. In Amen. the precious name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. How are you feeling right now? It has come down. It has come down. It's gone completely. Amen. I saw a demon. Immediately you came on the camera, I saw it. Amen. You know, petty demons, you know. You need sometimes, eh? It's not you need to before you start taking medicine for things, patients, and this is for you because you do that a lot. Immediately you are sick. The first thing you do is rush for medicine. Isn't it so? Yeah. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. What you need to do is put your hand where it is and rebuke it. Is a spirit. Mm -hmm. Most of the time, afflictions are spirit. The glory of God is here. The glory of God is here. The glory of God is here. They're so bright in this place, my God. Rebuke it, all right? And be right. free. You realize that you rebuke it, you give yourself five minutes, the thing has gone. Because these medicines you keep taking, it has side effects, oh. Yeah. And it's bringing something upon you. Huh? Don't be too quick to reach for the medicine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. There's power in your mouth. Do you know that? As a child of the living God, say, I command the pain, I command this sickness to leave me. And most of the time, you experience a lot of weakness in your legs. Yes. Yeah. I command weakness to go in the name of Jesus. Put your hands on your legs and command them. Jesus will back your prayers. Don't be afraid. Don't think Jesus won't listen to you. He will. All right? All right. Man. All right. You are blessed. Amen. You are blessed. God bless Amen. you. Amen. Thank you. Who else felt something moving? Some of you, other people felt something moving when I was praying. Who else? Somebody else too felt something moving. Who else felt something moving when I was praying, when I was talking, you felt something else moving. Who was that person? Let me pray for you. Come against that demon. Kadabashaya. Release the house and share. 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 Who was that person? Somebody said they felt heat. There's some of, some of you, you feel heat in your body. Yeah, because you're being healed. That is what the healing power is. It heals you. There's somebody watching me. You feel heat on your right hand after drinking the water. Anana, we thank God. That is the healing power of God. Somebody else felt something moving. Who was that? While I was talking, while I was praying, you felt something was moving inside you. You felt something moving inside you. Bar Barbara, Barbara, come to the camera quickly. You felt something moving inside you while I was praying. It is the demon reacting to my voice. Kadaba Sude Mehaya. Mine, yours was burning. All right. You felt something moving when I was praying? Yes, here. In your heart too? Well, first it, it was aching, like a pain. Uh -huh. And then when I started praying, it started moving. When it, first it was aching like a pain. Like a pain, like a, like a chest pain? Uh-huh. Yes. But then immediately then, I started praying. It was just moving. Yes, that's it was trying... happening. Yeah, I felt it like, you know, like when somebody, something jiggles and moves. Uh -huh, uh -huh, and uh -huh. I don't feel the pain it anymore. Was, but it's the, you, do you feel the pain? It's gone. You are healed. Ha! Ha da da boshaya. The power of God is all over you. The power of God is all over you. You feel it all over you. That is the power of God, my sister. Oh, I thank God for your life. You are healed. You are healed. 
The demon left. It left. It left. It left. It left. It left. I was afraid to give my testimony because I'm shy. I'm you are shy. shy. To... Don't be shy. God has healed you. Jesus Christ has visited you. Oh. I've been dealing with this for so many years. How long? How many years have you been dealing with it? Um, more than 10 years. More than 10 years. And I go to the doctors and they say there's nothing wrong. But then you they feel do, the pain. They do those uh, little things for the heart and nothing. And they said nothing is there. Not, nothing is wrong. I did a stress test for my heart. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the, the heart doctor. And he says there's nothing. Huh. You just have irritation because you have a lot of anxiety. Uh -huh. But it's gone. Oh! That is the Jesus we serve. Lift your hands. Yes. I, power, right? I want the power of God to come over you. Yes, Jesus, please. You are going through a lot. Yes. A lot of. Give me your power. My, my thing is going to. Hold on. My battery is going to. I need a, to. No plug problem. In. I'll wait for you. I don't you. want to lose the connection because I've been wanting. I can't. I, I'll wait for you. Get, get, go and get it. The power of God is all over you. The power of God is already visiting you. Jesus, the power of God you. is already visiting you. Even now. Listen to me. Those of you that are watching, release the heart. Release the heart and tap into the oh transfer God. of power. You feel heat all over you. You know that God is with you. You feel God with you. Oh. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Have you been able to... When you're done, when, take your time. I'm waiting. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> My God, this woman has been waiting to be healed for 10 years. Yes. Ten God has been good years. to me, but I have a lot of stuff too. Why don't you share? All those of you that are watching, all 290 of you, why don't you share? I was so embarrassed because I'm not like, call me no. Oh, I don't be embarrassed. Hair. I'm bald under. I have no hair. <laughs> Look, I'm I have no hair. Beautiful. I'm bald under. You're beautiful. I cut I my hair, so don't be, don't be shy. There are many people, God is healing them, but they will not come on because they are shy. They don't feel like their hair is combed. And many people, yeah, many. it's not just you. I thank God for your life because you take so much time I, I do. to come for us. I do. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I bless God for your life. Jesus, is your you, is your phone being charged? Yes, it's, it's it's. I think so. I don't want to lose the connection. All right, let me it pray with you quickly. Right? Yes, I release the unction of God over your life. Thank you. Jesus. In the name of Jesus, when you were young, you used to love God so much. Yes, I still do. You used to really love God with all your heart, and you used to even hear Him. When you were young, you used to hear God. <laughs> You used to have a really intimate relationship with him. I pray that they will go back to that place. Jesus loves you and he's looking for you, my dear. And today he's saying it's a turning point again. A second chance again. Go back to reading your Bible. Go back to worshiping him. Staying in a place quietly worshiping him and the, and the, and the joy he used to always give you. Let it be restored back. Father, I pray for this woman. I pray that every burden upon her be lifted in the name of Jesus. Give her rest, O oh Lord. Oh, the power of God is all over you. Oh, God. May the Lord lift every burden off of you. May the Lord lift every I burden. I don't know pray in tongues, but I know Jesus since I'm 10. Yeah, yeah. And I love him so You've known, much, the, you've I, known the Lord since you were a very young age. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I don't know. I just tell my family, why is it that the devil attacks me so much, so much, so yeah. much? Yeah. May the Lord lift every pain, every bitterness in your heart. May the Lord heal you. May the Lord heal your heart. May the Lord heal your heart and take away every bitterness and pain. Every pain. May the Lord give you a forgiving spirit to forgive and let go. Release the heart, mm. all of you. Release the heart. Release yes. the heart and share, share. I come yes. against every limitation that has been fighting you. I command every limitation. Break in the name of Jesus. I command every limitation. 
Break in the name of Jesus. Head every spirit of delay and frustration, struggle. May the hand of the Lord be lifted in your life from this day on forward. May you never be the same. In thank Jesus' you, Jesus. name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Lord, for your healing power upon this woman. Thank you, Jesus. I thank you for thank setting you. her free. Ten years of sickness. Ten yes. years of heart thank pain you. left. Thank yes. you, Lord. I bless your name. Thank you. Find a way to contact thank us. All right? I'll contact you. Don't worry. It is well. Okay. I want to thank help you. you come thank back. You so I want to help you come back to that place with yes. the thank intimacy. You. All right? God bless you. Oh, the power of God is here. Oh, the power of God is here. If the sickness is, is not a demon, then why is it moving? <laughs> why should a pain be moving around responding to my voice? If it's not from the devil, why should it be moving jiggery, jiggery, in your body? Why? Every moving pain in your body, I curse it in the name of Jesus. I curse every moving pain. Every pain that is moving in your body, all 300 of you, I curse it in the name of Jesus. I command every pain out. I curse it. In the master's name of Jesus, be set free now by the power of the Holy Ghost. Go ahead and share. Go ahead and share. Release the hearts. The power of God is here. The power of God is here. Go ahead and share. Go ahead and share. The power of God is here. Huh? Demons are moving. Demons are running. There's somebody watching me. When you drink the water, when you drink the water, those of you that just came on, just get a cup and say, I tap into the atmosphere and drink because the power of God is here. When you drink the water, you, you've been diagnosed with fibroid and you feel pain in your stomach. You feel heat in your stomach. You are watching me now. You drink the water. You've been diagnosed with fibroid and you feel heat. Immediately you drank the water, you felt heat in your stomach. You felt heat in your stomach. You felt heat, 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 heat in your stomach. You felt heat in your stomach. You are watching me right now. You felt heat in your stomach. You felt heat in your stomach. You felt heat in your stomach. You are watching me now. You felt heat in your stomach as I was praying. The Lord is telling me that go and get checked at your hospital you are free from fibroid in fact you don't need to go and get checked you don't need to go and get checked you are free you are free from your fibroid you are free you don't even need to go and get checked just you are free but if you want to go and get checked go and do it go and do like lydia did and let five doctors look at you and they're going to tell you you are free you are listening to my voice when i was praying and you drank the water you felt a burning sensation in your stomach. You felt it. You are free. You are free. You are free from it. 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 I want to pray for documents. I want to pray for documents. Oh my God. The power of God is so strong here. The Lord has healed that woman. I'm so happy. Ten years. Ten years of affliction. Going to the doctor and the doctor saying, Well, there's nothing there. You're just having heart palpitations. You're just having heart palpitations. You are just having an anxiety attack. But she said, I feel pain in my chest for ten years. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Kadabo shada bahaya. Hada daba shada badaba kabada badaba baba. Documents. I want to pray for documents. Those of you watching me under the sound of my voice, the Lord wants me to pray for documents. You are watching me. Documents. Please stay on. Stay on. Stay on. Kadaba sodebeya. The unction of God is here. The unction of God is here. Stay on. I'm going to pray and I'll be prophesying to people. 
I'm prophesying to people as the Lord leads me. The Lord is giving me plenty of people to, to uh, give a word of knowledge to, word of wisdom. Many, many people, many, many people are on. So make sure you stay. But I want to do this. Uh, corporate prayers and get them out of the way quickly and then go into the next session do these corporate prayers i pray in the name of jesus i tap into daniel's testimony of the 72 hour miracle for everyone under the sound of my voice needing documents needing visas needing immigration papers I pray for you. There's somebody watching me. Somebody took your money to do papers for you. And the person has gone missing. Who's that person? Who's that person? You are watching me. Somebody took your money to go and do papers for you. And you cannot find the person. Who's that person? Quickly say, woman of God, is me as I'm praying. You are watching me. Somebody say, a connection man, somebody you know, said, let me go and do the paper for you. They took your money. Lime sum of money. And you can't find them and you are losing your mind you are losing your mind you cannot find them and you are losing your mind who's that person i want to pray for you who's that person i want to pray for you father in the name of jesus anyone under the sound of my voice looking for documents has applied for documents has a put in application for schools application for school has put in application for things. I pray in the mighty name of Jesus that you will visit them by the power of the Holy Ghost. Anyone under the sound of my voice, Kadabasudi Bihaya, applications for immigration, for jobs, Kadabasu, interviews, Kadabasaya, Panimikapaya, may the favor of God, Kadabasudiya. Pan Tony Kapaya, Matoni Mikapa, Pan Tanama Suni Mikapaya. May the favor of God, may the favor of God, may the favor of God locate you in the name of Jesus. May the miracle work in God. Ah. May the Jesus who works miracles, may Jesus who works miracles, may that Jesus visit you. In the name of Jesus, may favor locate you. May the immigration officers begin to work on your papers and may it favor you. In the name of Jesus, I command every satanic attack against your immigration to come to a halt now by the power of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. Any limitation any evil hand any evil hand any evil hand kadabasuya panika toya pataya panika tanamasuya kapaya that is selling you to make you be stagnant and that you will not move forward hey 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 in the name of jesus in the name of Jesus, I command that hand break. In the name of Jesus, I command that hand break and release the heart. All of you, release the heart. I don't know why you are not releasing the heart. I don't know why you are just watching me and you're not releasing the heart. I don't know why. Why will you just be watching and not releasing the heart? Why will you just be watching and not releasing the heart? Why will you just be watching and not releasing the heart? Kidaba Shahaya. You know you need the move of God in your life. Command every demonic hand. Break in the name of Jesus. Break in the name of Jesus. Be set free. I release your documents for you. I release your documents for you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Spiritual marriages. 
spiritual marriages. Somebody just came on and I saw a snake. Hmm. I saw a snake, but the snake caught fire. <laughs> Somebody just entered, came on the Facebook live, and the demonic, the, the, the spiritual marriage that is causing that person to be, to be broken and downhearted, that spiritual marriage has come to an end. It just came to an end. The spiritual marriage just came to an end. Because the snake that you came on with just caught fire. I tell you guys, release the heart. Release the heart because the power of God is here. You're not listening. I saw a snake. Now, somebody came on now. You are struggling with spiritual marriages. Immediately you came on. The snake that is following you caught fire. Hmm. 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 Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. The snake that is following you now caught fire. Caught fire. Caught fire. There's somebody watching me. You are a man. There's chains around your neck, around your, your feet. You are not able to move forward in life. You are struggling. You are struggling. You are struggling to move forward in life. Release the hearts and share. Listen to me. The power of God is here. Power of God is here. Kadaba Sodebeha. Spiritual marriages. Anyone under the sound of my voice struggling with spiritual marriages? Please lift your hands quickly. After that, I'll go into the prophetic. I'll go into the prophetic. You are watching me. This is the first time you've come on. You're struggling with spiritual marriages. You are. You are. You are. You are. You are. You're struggling with spiritual marriages. I pray for you. In the name of Jesus, you have come on to Mount Zion. Yeah, this is Mount Zion. Snakes better not come follow you. No. Here, demons fall. <laughs> demons fall. Somebody just came on. Oh. I don't even know if the person is still on. But I saw the snake caught fire. This is this is Mount Zion. <laughs> That's why I keep telling you, invite people, invite your family people to come on because some of these things I don't need to have to pray for. As long as they come on, whatever demonic affliction call, it, afflicting them has to leave. I don't even have to open my mouth and pray because this particular place here is zoned out for God. Nothing demonic is able to sustain to stay in this atmosphere that is why when i was talking demons were moving the demon that was afflicting those people those infirmities were moving when i was talking why will a pain be moving why is it that the pain is there you are feeling the pain all of a sudden i'm somebody's talking and the pain is moving because it's a demon and so demons must not be able to come here and survive yeah and that is why i saw the snake catch fire Everyone that is watching me, you are going through spiritual marriages. You are going through spiritual marriages. Release the heart. Kidabashaya. You are going through spiritual marriages. May the hand of Jehovah be lifted in your life. I declare and I decree under this atmosphere that that marriage come to an end. That spiritual marriage must come to an end in the name of Jesus. That spiritual marriage must come to an end in the name of Jesus. That spiritual marriage must come to an end by the power of the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name. Mm. Mm. Hello. Hello. How are you, sir? Can you turn the light on? I, I can barely see. Quickly, please. Can you turn the light on? Yes, yeah, sure. Okay, do that. Quickly. What's going on with you, sir? What do you do in life? I am a, uh, I'm a computer technician. Engineer. and I'm a You're an engineer? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yes. I know. I know. I was, the Lord said he's an engineer. <laughs> Why do you ask him what he's doing in his life? You are very, you have a glorious future. Amen. 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 
Which country are you norm are you from in general? Like where? I'm from Nigeria. You're from Nigeria. You have a very yeah. glorious future. Like all there are a lot of successful people from your family. Your family in general, everybody is successful. Like everybody is yes. doing well. Yes. 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 Are you struggling with uh um hypertension? Yes. 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 Are you married? Yes, I'm married. How many children? I have three kids. You have a boy? Yes. Very dignified boy. Yes. You want yes. that boy to be an engineer, but he's not an engineer. Yes. Yes. You know that he's not yes. an engineer. He's not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a very, very, very brilliant boy. Yes. And you need to pray for him, guide him well. Amen. Be careful of young girls that will come into his life. Amen. Be careful of the women, the girls. Well, because he has a very good heart. I feel yes. that he will he will come across one of these young witches. You know. Yes. <laughs> Somebody with not a good spirit. You understand what I'm saying? Yes, yes. Yeah. You are a very blessed man. There's glory mm. all over you. Mm. So commit yourself to God. What church do you go to? I go to Redeem. Redeem Christian. Yeah. It's a good church. I go and I sing there sometimes. I sing there sometimes. I want to pray for you for the hypertension. Okay. Oh, your free, your videos froze. See if you can come back on again. See if you can come back on again. See if you can come back on again. See if you can come back on again so I can pray for you. He's struggling with hypertension. Very bad, very bad, very bad hypertension. Young witches, oh, mommy. Hmm. <laughs> she said, Young witches, pa. You know, you don't know. <laughs> Nowadays, these kids, they are not afraid to say they are a witch, oh. Hey, I will tell you right away, I'm a witch. And they're very, very proud of it. Hey, hmm. Let me say it, oh. Hmm. Let me say it. That boy has a, such a great destiny. That boy is going to be an entrepreneur. Owns so many businesses. Such a great destiny upon his life. He has to be careful who he's hanging around with. Oh, sir, please come back on. Let me pray for you. Where is he? Where is he? Father, I pray for this man in the name of Jesus. I pray that his thing will work. I don't know why. Some of these things... It cuts and there's a there's a real release the heart and share release the heart release the heart when you come on release the heart. I wish he will come back on. I wish he will come back on. So I pray for him, but it is well. It is well. If he comes back on, I'll pray for him. Chinumso. Come on, please. Hi. Hello. Why do I feel like I know you? Have I prayed for you before? <laughs> no, this is my first time. It's your first time. Can you sit up a little bit? Yeah. Okay. Do you mind maybe putting some clothes on and then come back on the camera? Is that all right? Okay, no problem. God bless you. I don't want all the single women to lose their mind. Okay. Sir, I want to pray yeah, my, for you. My phone died. I know. You see the devil. He's <laughs> very funny. Your phone right. didn't die yeah, until the right. time I call on you. That's when it dies. <laughs> 
right. I am right. on to his devices. Don't worry. Amen. I'm on. Amen. I'm willing to wait. I'm willing to wait. Amen. Please put your hand on your chest for me. Father, in the name of Jesus, I commit this man into your hands. I declare and I decree in the name of Jesus that Amen. this pain in his heart, this hypertension Amen. issue, yes. will come down in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, that his heart rate will be normalized. The blood pressure Amen. will be normalized. This will Amen. not be passed on to his children in the name of Jesus. I Amen. pray that whatever he received from his parents, it will not be passed on to him, his children. Amen. In the name of Amen. Jesus, I pray that you will grant him continuous health. Amen. In the name of Jesus, let your peace Amen. abide in his home. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Lord, give him discernment. Amen. Lord, reveal to him what he needs to know concerning his family. Yes. Yes, I thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. You, Amen. Jesus. Amen. Yeah. Immediately, I was about to call. The Lord said to me, you are an engineer. So I know that. Um, yes. Yeah, you are. You are. You are very brilliant. You don't want to have any more kids. Um, I do want to have some more kids. Yeah. You do? Yeah. Who doesn't want? Does your wife want to have more kids too? <laughs> yes. Really? Yes. <laughs> I don't know why I said that you didn't want to have it, but that's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. The the kids from your from your family, your family is blessed. I see that your parents mm -hmm. serve God very well too. Yes. Is there anybody in your family that is a pastor? Um, my auntie. My auntie is a pastor. Your auntie is a pastor. Your yes. from your mother's side or your father's side? From my father's side. Your father's side. Yeah. Yes. Very very God fearing family. You are good. Built on that. All right. Commit your Amen. ways to God. You'll be well. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. You'll be well. Is your father still alive? Yes, my father and mother are still alive. Good. Good. I pray yes. for long health for you. I come Amen. against anything that will serve us. Uh, it is settled. Were you on when I prayed mm -hmm. over the water? Yes, I did. I did. Okay, uh, and, and, and today it's my first time joining you. I really? I um I just saw you online and I just clicked you on just it. Joined. So was, are you enjoying yes, yourself? Yes, yes. Yes. Yeah. God is yeah. good. I thank God. I hope you will thank share. You. you will follow us. We do teachings. Yeah. I, tried to, I, I tried to I um, tried to add you, but it said you are too. Yeah, my uh, friends list are full. So just follow yeah. the page. Yeah. Okay. Just follow the page. God bless okay. you, sir. May his hand thank be lifted you in your life. Your Amen. mother has released blessings over you. I yes. don't know. Has she told you that? Or you she know pray for me. You pray for me all the time. I know, but she has received, released a specific blessings over you. And Amen. I see them hanging over you like that. Amen. Your Amen. mother is very, very prayerful. And yes. I see the prayers yes. hanging over you like that. You know, love on her. You know, call her. Yes. It, her prayers are really doing it for you, to be honest. Amen. Yeah. Amen. And love on your mother. Her prayers are really, I see them. It's like a cloud just hanging over you. And it's a good thing. I bless God for your life, sir. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much, man. Please pray for your what your children, oh, huh? As a mother, pray for them. Release blessings over them. I see like a cloud. That's why this man, his life is just blossoming. You know, I mean, a few sicknesses here, but you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Pray for your children. Pray over your children. Hmm. Pray over your children. Pray over your children. Very, very important. Don't just be sitting in the house always. I oh, come you're so bad. How come you're so difficult? How come you're so this? Always releasing curses upon your children. This woman has released so much blessings upon the son, eh? That even if he is to go to a place, even if he is to go to a place, even if he's to go to a place and it's like a bad, evil place, they cannot speak against him. Because the prayers of the mother is literally hanging upon him. And some of you, you don't understand the power you have in your mouth as a mother to bless your children. So don't be cursing. Hey, you're so bad. You're so terrible. And that's why you do bad in school. That's why you continue to do bad in school. That's why you continue to do bad in school. Don't do that. Don't do that.
Some of you need to be delivered from the spirit of anger. Anger. Immediately you open your mouth, you are, you are, you are, you are cursing somebody. Huh? You always curse it. You don't know how to bless. It's not good. It's not good. I thank God for your, your mother's life, sir. Please, go and cherish your mother. Call your mother and tell her that I salute her. I salute her. She's a good woman. She's a good woman. You must always pray for your children. Never let it come out of your mouth to curse a child. Never. Because as a parent, it will follow them. You have power over them. Please, Ernest, accept the camera quickly. I don't have time, sir. In came Emma, quickly. In came Emma, quickly. All right, well. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Release the hearts. Release the hearts and pray. Release the hearts and pray. Patience, how are you feeling now? I trust that you are all better. I thank God for his healing power in your life. I thank God for his healing power in your life. Larissa, the Lord is telling me to pray for you. Larissa, let me pray with you quickly. I set the camera quickly. Let me pray with you. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Larissa, I need to pray with you quickly. Thank you, Lord. Release our hearts. Release our hearts. Thank you, sir. I don't know why you requested to come on the camera for me to pray with you, but you didn't have a shirt on. Hey! Temptation. I have single women on here. Who... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's all right. How are you doing, sir? I'm fine. Thank God. You're Nigerian? No. Which country are you from? I'm from Nigeria, but I'm in South America. I'm in Ecuador. That's what I'm saying. You are, I said you are Nigerian. That's what okay, I said. Yes, I'm, yeah. yes. You are Nigerian. And you are in South yes. America right now. Yes. You know what I saw? No. Would you say that you are reconsidering if you should have come to South America. Yes, it's true. You are. You are. Yes. It's correct. Yeah. You are struggling. It it's wasn't true. as how you thought it to be. It will be. Exactly. 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 I see you literally sitting in a box. And your hands are like this. But you are hard working and you want to work. You want to get out. And this is, this is what I see. I see you trying to get out. But the more you punch, the punches are reflecting back to you. Mr. I'm going to pray for you. For the Lord to make a way for you out. Amen. 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 And the Holy Ghost is telling me that you followed a friend's counsel to come to South Africa. It's true. South America. It, it was a friend, South America, yeah. Yes. You followed a friend. Yes, it's true. Never do that again. Okay. You understand? Can you sit okay. up? Can you sit up? Yeah. Never do that again. Okay. Because you have such a bright future. 
I wish you had stayed in Nigeria. You would have been fine. You know this. Yeah. Yeah. You would have been fine in Nigeria. Because the favor of God is over your life. You will be fine. I pray for you. The Lord who makes a way where there is no way. I pray that that God will make a way for you. Amen. Amen. If I ask you, by the count to ten, how good is your work with God? What would you say from one to ten? Honestly. Honest. Not exactly right. Yes, not exactly. Even I though I feel, I feel like making it right, but it's not easy. Right. It's hard. Your work with God is hard. Yes, it's true. You used to also be... Let's not go there. It's not necessary. Your dreams too, they are not helping you. You have some... Uh, dreams a woman in your dreams you know what I'm talking about right yes. yeah is your mother still alive no yeah I'm going to pray for you I'm going to pray a prayer of true heartfelt because you need God to move in your life. Why do I pray for you? Because I see a star over you and it's still there. So there's still hope. You understand what I'm saying? There's still hope. And I'm going to pray that the Lord, the angels of the living God and the cry of your late mother will locate you. Amen. And then just put you back on the path of your destiny again. You understand? We've all made mistakes. Many, many women are on that married wrong men. <laughs> and God is making a way for them. So God will make a way for you. I mean, it's not a funny matter, but it's the truth. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. Can you close your eyes and lift your hands? And I also want you to give your life back to Christ. Would that be okay? Would you be willing to do that? Yes. I cannot hear you at all, sir. If you can speak up a yes, little bit. Yes, I can You'll be willing that. to I give your life to Christ. That. Yes, I desire oh. it so much. You desire it? Yes. All right. And I want you to follow our page because I want to help you. I do. I know the situation seems like it cannot be done. But I know yes. the God that I serve. Huh? Okay. Yeah. Okay. And I know that you think you cannot get your way out, but you can. Okay, thank you. Okay. Because if that's not the case, I will not call you to the camera to pray for you. I will not. Lord, so no. just say this after me. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. I thank you. I thank you. I believe that you are the son of God. I believe you are the son of God. I believe that you died. I believe that you died. And on the third day you rose again. And on the third day, you rose again. Come into my life. Come into my life. Come into my heart. Come into my heart. Be Lord of my life. Be the Lord of my life. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. Forgive me of my sins. Forgive me all my sins. Have mercy on me, Lord. Have mercy on me, Lord. And deliver me. And deliver me. And deliver me. And deliver me, Lord. And deliver me. And deliver me. From the snare of the fowler. From the snare of the fowler. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Let me pray with you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I commit this son, man into your hands. I pray that your mighty hand will be lifted in his life, Lord. He Amen. showed me that he is in a cage. Lord Jesus, you are a way maker. Make a way for this man. Amen. In the name of Jesus. 
Amen. We have all made mistakes. We have listened to wrong counsel. All of us. None of us are perfect. But Lord, you made a way for me. Many times, you made me to escape my bad decision making. I pray that you do the same for him, Lord. Have mercy Amen. on him. Father, Amen. within a week, within a week, within a week, give Amen. him the testimony you gave to Daniel. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. I come Amen. against any foul spirit that tried to attack you in a dream. I curse that spirit. Amen. I command every covenant between you and that spirit broken in the name of Jesus. Amen. May Amen. Lord deliver you from every demonic Amen. attack, every water spirit that Amen. fights you through dreams. I curse that spirit. I command Amen. that spirit to leave you in the matchless Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. God bless you. So follow our page, okay? Okay. God bless you. Release the heart, release the heart. Way maker, release the heart, release the heart and share. Share, share, share. Release the heart. Hi. Are you laying now or you are sitting? We're about to sleep, actually. <laughs> Can you get yeah. up, please? Okay. Quickly, quickly. Okay. okay, how are you? Where Where are you? Are you in South Africa? No, I'm in New York. You are in New, New York? York. Yeah. Where are you from? I'm from Nigeria. Really? Yeah. I bless God for your life. Are you in school? Yes. What are you doing? Nursing? No, um, cosmetology. Makeup? Yes. Oh, so you people, you also wear scrubs too, eh? <laughs> you wear yeah. scrubs? Yes. Uh, me, I see people wear scrubs. I say they are nurses, oh. <laughs> no. Oh. We wear scrubs, we wear aprons. Ah, because I'm like, you look like a nurse. <laughs> All right. It is well. Amen. Amen. I just woke up to your page and um I saw the prayers. So mm. I said, let me follow. Let me tap into it. Yes. Are you married? Yes. How long have you been married? Mm, ten years now. Ten. You yeah. look good. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The Lord wants me to pray for you for favor. <laughs> Okay. You need favor. Yes. I need you are, favor. You, you, you are too beautiful to be struggling. <laughs> Everybody is beautiful. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But yeah. you need favor. You, you know, your family has served God. Yes. Yeah. My father was a pastor. You, in your father is a pastor, eh? Yeah. 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 But there's a lot of challenge. Yes. There's who that I sense in my spirit that the like premature death. Ah, God forbid. I bring the kids. Not for you. No, 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 not for you. <laughs> but it's happening. No, no, no. Like no. people they don't live long before they mm, Yeah, my mother died early. Your mother died early. Yes. She said, God forbid. <laughs> <laughs> I like your faith. <laughs> yeah. She said, hey, that, that was a liar. I like that. Exactly. Aggressive. <laughs> but I wasn't yeah. talking about you. Oh. I was talking about somebody else in the family yes. that okay. died before their time. Oh, Lord, right. have mercy on you. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I know, but I your, know what you're talking about. Yeah, your My mother. mother side, yes. How old was she? She was around 30 something or 40. Early, wow. early, early in life. Yeah. Early, she died early yeah. in life. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to pray for you and have Thank that cancelled over you. Amen. Do you have another sister? How many girls are you guys? We're just two girls. Two girls. 
Yes. I want to. I saw. I saw another girl around you as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you also? In, is she also in New York? Yes. All right. I pray for both of you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I declare that what whatever Amen. the fate of your mother was, yeah. it will Amen. not be the same for you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. You will not suffer the fate of your mother. Amen. Amen. In the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. May the hand of the Lord be lifted up upon you. Amen. May Amen. the favor of God come upon you. Amen. May the blessings of the Lord, Lord. that God gives to people who serve Him, Lord. may it come upon you in the name of Jesus. Amen. May your Father's blessings come upon you in the Amen. name of Jesus. Amen. May the rewards that your father has acquired by serving Lord. God faithfully, may it come upon Lord. you. Amen. May you begin to reap it in the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Amen. I thank Amen. God for your lives. Thank you, Jesus. I pray for your husband. Amen. I, does he have his documents? Yes. Okay. He does. All right. I don't know if he's looking for documents for something. Is he looking? <laughs> he's trying to be. He's, yeah, he's still waiting for some documents. That, that's true. You see, oh, some things. Yeah. He's looking for what? What documents is he looking for? Citizenship. Yeah, so that's what I said. Does he have his documents? You said, yeah. Yeah, he had. You know, it's step by step. But <laughs> he's still waiting for. Um, Oh, Yehovah. You know, it's the African way, eh? <laughs> <laughs> because I always have this positive mind. Like, <laughs> I believe it is done. Yeah. You know, I God. pray in the name of Jesus. Amen. That his documents will be given to him. No delay. Amen. I come against delay concerning Amen. his documents. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. May the mighty hand be lifted in his life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. May the favor Amen. of God come upon you and your sister. Amen. I cancel struggle out of your life Amen. in the name of Jesus. I thank Amen. God for your lives. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Name. Amen. 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 Thank you so much. I really appreciate this. You are praise. blessed. You are blessed. Amen. And you are right. blessed too, man. God bless you. <laughs> she said, "I, I, I forbid it." <laughs> the way she, the way she said, "I refuse it." It even startled me. <laughs> <You're ready. laughs> I like that. It's not everybody you prophesy to. Hey, be careful. <laughs> but I believe that it will not be her portion in Jesus' name. The fate of that thing that her mother suffered will not be her portion. Everyone under the sound of my voice. None of you will suffer a premature death in the name of Jesus. None of you will suffer a premature death in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Release the hearts. Release the hearts and share. Release the hearts when you come on. Release the hearts. Tap into the atmosphere and share. Tap into the atmosphere and share. Hello. Hello, prophet. Oh, I'm not a prophet, oh. I'm an evangelist. Okay, pastor. Oh, evangelist. <laughs> Well, I don't think Hello. I'm an I've not even been ordained, so I'm just just call me by Mrs. <laughs> All right. How are you? Hello. I'm fine, thank you. Do you have children? Yes. How many children? I have two boys. Mm. I pray for your boys, and they're both in school. Uh one is in school. The other one is starting next year. One is starting next year. So yes. The, the, the one that is in school, I pray for retentive memory for him. Amen. How Amen. are his, what, where, how far is he in school? Um, he's just here, uh, like a SK. He's going to grade one next year. Oh, a little boy. I come <laughs> yes, against anything. Really I come yes. against anything that will block him. May the Lord give him retentive memory. In Amen. the name of Jesus. Amen. May the Lord give him retentive memory. Amen. Amen. May the Lord give that boy a retentive memory. Amen. Be careful of your children and pray over them. Do you understand what I mean? Yes. Pray over your children. 
Yes. Huh? I know what I'm saying. Yes. There are others women on them, and the Lord is even telling me to pray over their children. The same prayer I'm praying for you. The Lord is telling me to pray the same for their children. Amen. And spend time trying to read books with them. Okay. You understand? Yes. I pray for your children in the name of Jesus. Amen. May the hand Amen. of the Lord be lifted in your life. May the favor of God be on their portion. Retentive Amen. memory, photogenic memory. May the spirit Amen. of wisdom be in them, even as a young child. May the spirit Amen. of wisdom be upon them, even as a young Amen. child. Amen. The Amen. May the hand Amen. of the Lord be lifted in his life. I come Amen. against anything that will cause him to be not be able to articulate very well. I curse it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Where is your husband? Uh, he's at home. He's downstairs. How is his job? Ah, uh, it's it's just a little, not that great. Uh, for almost two years now. Yeah. 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 It's very frustrating for him. Has he told you that? Uh, yes, I know that. Yeah. Your husband is very frustrated by his job situation. Yes. I pray that the Lord will connect him. He needs divine Amen. connection. When you are praying Amen. for your husband, pray for divine connection. Amen. Amen. Okay. Lord, divine. I pray for divine connection for my husband. I pray for divine Amen. connection. Lord, connect him to the right people. Amen. Connect him to the right people, Lord. Connect him. That's Amen. the prayer you need to pray. The reason why I called you out was because of your boys. All right. The Lord wants to use your boys, not necessarily use them as in, um, but they'll be very, very successful in life, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. they will, they will support the work of God. They'll be very, very rich. Mm -hmm. Amen. But you and your husband need to stay together. I know that mm -hmm. in your family, a lot of marriages don't. I don't know how to say this. Yeah, but, like separation. You know? Yeah, a lot of separations. That's true. So that's mm -hmm. that's where I'm heading to. The reason why I called you was because of your boys. You and your husband need to stay together. Yeah. Do you understand? If yes. you two don't stay together and you end up separating like all the other people that have separated in your family, you are going to cause these boys' lives to be very, very tough. Do you understand? Yes. yes. I pray. Does your husband have children outside your marriage? None that I know of. Okay, no, he does not. I'm just, I'm just asking. But I pray for all of you in the name of Jesus. Amen. But I'm expecting husband. another baby. Well, I'm sorry? You are expecting another I'm, baby? I'm pregnant, yeah. Okay. I pray for all of you. My, it's, important to, it, it's important to the Lord that you keep your family together. Whatever you have to do as a woman. And I pray for wisdom for you. Because Amen. what you're fighting is a, is a familiar spirit. And it's like everybody is separated. Everybody is separated. You know? And if you're not careful, you'll fall under that same line. But because of the children that you have, you two have to stay together. This yes. is a very profound word I'm giving you. And this word must stay with you. Amen. Unless, of course, I hope that you come up, you go to church, you come across a prophet who will also say the same thing I'm saying to you to confirm it for you. It is very important that you and your husband stay together for the sake yes. of the future of your children. Okay. Uh, yes. God bless you. May the hand of the Lord be lifted Jesus. of your life. Amen. I pray that your pregnancy will be smooth. Amen. I pray for your husband. Amen. I pray for your husband that the Lord will show him mercy. Amen. God be gracious unto him. Amen. Amen. That he'll be divinely connected to people who will help him. Amen. Jesus, I pray with us, given. Amen. Amen. God bless Amen. you. Follow our Amen. Page. Follow our teachings. Amen. All right. Yes. Thank you so much. God bless you. I pray for all of you under the sound of my voice. Any one of you that your marriage is under a threat. Any one of you that your marriage is under a threat. Your marriage is under a threat. Your marriage is under a sort of a threat. I pray for you in the name of some of these things. It is because of the kids. Oh. It's not because of you. Oh. 
is because of the kids. Because a house divided can never stand. When you scatter the head, when you kill the, the, the shepherd, you scatter the sheep. You understand? So most of these attacks of marriages, it comes because of the destiny of the children. And so if you don't have that wisdom, and you say, well, my husband has done this, my wife has done this, I'm just going to go ahead and break up with them, I'm just going to go ahead and divorce them, you are in serious danger. You are in serious danger. And you are endangering the lives and the destinies of your children. Marriage, what immediately the case come in is no longer about you. Some of you, you don't understand that. Immediately the children come in, you, the man and the woman, release the hearts. This is pure wisdom. It's no longer about you. It is no longer about you guys. Immediately the children come in. It's no longer about you. It's no longer about you. No longer. No longer about you. And you have to pray. Some of this contention and confusion is the devil. The devil so sees in your heart, in your mind. And I'm preaching this because the Lord is telling me 50 of you need what I'm saying. 50 of you need what I'm saying. 50. You have to find a way to work out the argumentativeness in your family, in your marriage, especially the men. And you need to learn to deal with your wives in wisdom for the sake of your children. You know, taking care of children isn't just the fact that you go to work, you come home, you give them money, you take them to school, you buy their clothes for them, you give them a roof of your head. No! Never be mistaken that when you do that, you're taking care of children. is a complete lie from the pit of hell. You don't care for children alone by providing for them. You don't do that. It is important that the hedge you have conjoined with your wife is never broken. Never broken. The conjunction the, the, the thing that you have gathered together is never broken. I'll become much I'll be praying for you. I'll be praying for you shortly. It's never broken. Make sure that you don't let another woman come and take your mind away from your marriage. Make sure you don't let another man come and take your mind away from your husband. Because at the end of the day, the devil is not targeting any of you. This is what I'm saying is pure wisdom. Some of you, you've sat on all this while to hear this. You've sat on all this while just to hear this. The attack is not for you or your children. It's not for you or your husband. It's for your children. Because once the hedge is broken over them, the kids struggle. And sometimes you put their destinies in danger. That's why you will go and statistically, those kids that people that are in prison, mostly their kids are not together. Why is it so that they will do the statistics and people who are in prison, most of them is because their children their parents are not together and you think that oh well I, I, well we don't care he doesn't care about me i don't care about me and we are unhappy together we are unhappy together so let's just divorce who told you who told you you gotta be careful you gotta be way wise it's not about you it's not about you any longer. When the kids are in, it's about the kids, the future of them. In ruin. You need wisdom to deal with one another. Sacrifice. 
Sacrifice. Sacrifice. And humility. Both the husband and the wife. Hmm. Me, I'm a child of divorce, so I know what I'm talking about. Do you understand? I'm telling you this. Release the heart. I am a child of divorce. And I've been struggling. I The way, you know, once the hedge is broken, you struggle. It's about the kids. Remember, always remember that. It's about the kids. Marshall, where are you? Please come to the camera quickly. Let me pray with you, Marshall. Kandabasuri, release the heart. Release the heart. Release the heart. It's not easy. And once you do that, you put your case in the predicament to also uh, come from a broken home divorce as well. This thing is like a, it's like a running thing. It's very, very important. Please, I beg you. I beg you. Be very, 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 very careful. Fight for your marriage. Unless, of course, the man is killing you or the woman is trying to kill you, then you have to run. As for that, you have no choice. But if it's menial pride issues, menial pride, I'm the one who said it first. You are the one who said it first. I'm the one who said it first. I'm the one who's going to say it last. I'm the man. I'm the man. Ah, I'm the man. I'm your wife. I'm the woman. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Do away with the pride. It's not about you. It's not about you. It's about the destinies of your children. Do away with it. Hmm. This thing I've said, I have, I, have, I have dealt with most of your problems. Some of you, I don't need to come to call you to the camera. If you take the word, I have canceled about half of the people I have to prophesy to. I've canceled it. It's dealt with now. Check. 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 